Welcome, Tecmo Super Bowl fans, to another online Tecmo Super Bowl tournament group play matchup. Recording started right at the beginning of the kickoff, start of the first quarter. We have Odell representing the Chicago Bears and Lincoln Hawk representing the Los Angeles Raiders. Good run to start the game by Lincoln Hawk. Another good run by Bo Jackson. Down past the 40-yard line. Danelle Wilford with the tackle. Odell sticking with uh, Carrier on this play. Jackson attacking the top. Another first down. Moving the ball effectively. Odell doing a good job mixing up the defenders that time going with Singletary was able to break through the line and win that isolation tap opportunity. This time going with Perry, the nose tackle, popcorning Marcus Allen, rather the center. Marcus Allen goes by him and he's able to isolate Jackson for a tapping opportunity. And there we have a fumble, folks. Covered by the Bears, Odell takes over. First and 10 for Odell near the 20 yard line. Offset eye formation. Pass two. Passes to Anderson, fastest player in the field. First down. Pro set formation. Great moves by Anderson. Gets into the clear and finally gets caught up. Gets caught up by the pack. And we are near the 50-yard line for Odell. Into Raider territory. Lincoln Hawk using Greg Townsend. QB run there. Called pass four. Can't complete the pass to Bailey on the hot route, and we have a third down coming up. Offset eye formation. And we have a run one offset eye. Anderson easily gets the first down. Townsend cannot break off and get down to stop the tackle, or stop the run. Semi goes with Anderson. We have a run up the middle, offset eye, run four. And Anderson is just destroying these linebackers. They cannot keep up with him. Shotgun formation. Tom's like just taking what he can get. Four yards closer. We have a pass four, which is called. And it's intercepted. In the end zone, leaving points on the board. Run to Bo Jackson. Second and third starting the second quarter. Back-to-back -back run threes called this time. Tackle for a loss in the, back, in the backfield. Checking conditions here. Burline's in bad. He's going to stick with Jay Schrader. Bo's fine. Marcus Allen's fine. Galt's bad. Ethan Horton is good. Surprised we don't have a change of wide receiver based on the condition there. Mark Carrier the selection this time on defense for Odell. Completes to Allen underneath. And another fumble. This time Trace Armstrong picks up the fumble. And we have a first down in Raider territory for the Bears. Shotgun play. Odell just takes the yards he can get. Run up the middle. Run four. It's caused some traffic, but actually is able to break loose here. And it's just getting out juked with that 50. 
moving speed right off the bat there. Wide open in the end zone. Morris can't complete the catch. Good time to check conditions. They don't get more wide open than that. That close to the end zone. See Dennis Gentry make an appearance in the game. Again, called pass four. Third down, decision time. How do we want to attack this? Are we going to go try to shorten up the field for fourth down? Anderson gets a block that holds and is able to get into the end zone. So Odell strikes first. Six points with Neil Anderson. Extra point incoming. Give him Butler with the doinker there. Lickenhawk will try to match scores here. He's had two unfortunate fumbles. You think Jackson with all that ball control would have a little better time holding on the ball, but uh, hasn't been the case today. Stinson, the ball carrier, runs right at him. First down is achieved. Over Odell seems to have the tap advantage in this matchup. Mark carry the defender. Run one, up and A. So Jackson doesn't get much, three yards on the play. Offset eye formation. Carry the defender, run four up the middle. Bounces outside. Had a blocker with him. There might have been an opportunity if he could make that blocker engage to break free there. Uh, but he gets a first down out of it and goes to a run three. For some reason, uh, just doesn't get a really good block pattern there. Minimal gain on that play. Pass for the call. Jay Schrader takes too long to let that ball go and makes Mark Carrier makes him pay the price. Turnover at the 50. Short field again for the Bears. Run two called up the middle. Bailey not quite as fast as Anderson, but still solid back. Being utilized very effectively here. Offset eye formation. Towns on the selected defender. Run one, offset eye, sweep to the bottom. Anderson gets out of bounds. Just in time for that field goal attempt. Plenty of time for Butler as the linebackers are just not fast enough to rush that kicker. So we started with a scoreless first quarter but we end up with 10 points and a 10 point lead for Odell in the second and the ball to start the third. Lincoln Hawk will need to play stellar defense and hope for a turnover like in the first possession. Gentry still in good condition. Offset eye formation, first down on the 23. Run four is called. Anderson breaks through, but he also fumbles it. But the Tecmo gods appear to be on Odell's side. Dennis Gentry scoops up the fumble. First down as a result of the play. Offset eye formation. Run one, which is something that has been quite effective so far for Odell. Anderson is now breaking free. And I think he accidentally ran out of bounds there. I, I don't think that was an intentional uh, run out there. Crow said here we might see a Bailey call, but instead it's the pass three. Try to go with the burn route down as wide receiver two, but Tom Zach just can't make that throw. Beastly with a one-on-one -on -one opportunity there. Cuts back in the drone dive. Makes contact. He goes down third down and four. Pro set here. This time we do see the dive play. 
Bailey is able to break away. Anderson gets caught up in the mess. And it's a touchdown for Johnny Bailey. And we're now looking at a three-score deficit for Lincoln Hawk, who started the first quarter out pretty well, uh, experienced two turnovers that really were just kind of fluke things, and, and then we piled on with that that, that interception, uh, that the, the late delivery on that pass four really cost him. Uh, we're now looking at 17 points here. Um, as far as time is concerned, uh, it's definitely doable, however... Um, Stopping the Bears is not the easiest thing in the world with their running attack. And scoring in a hurry is not always the easiest. Even though they do have fast receivers, Jay Schrader has, a, has some difficulty getting the ball to those receivers. Galt, the recipient of this throw. And Carrier strikes again. Another interception. And I think he'll wisely just take it out of bounds so he doesn't accidentally fumble on his own end of the field. So we have four turnovers now against the Raiders. And the uh, Bears are in full control. Led by Odell. Run three to the top. Pro set. Great blocking. Anderson not contested until about the 30-yard line. Takes it out of bounds. We have a first down to 10 at the 30-yard line with an offset eye formation against Anderson. Pass two is called. Anderson a little sluggish right now. Looks to be possibly, uh, I would guesstimate, in somewhere in bad condition. Anderson looking a little faster on that play, but it doesn't seem to matter. Run one takes it to the house for Neil Anderson. And now it's a track meet, folks. Soon to be, it's 23 nothing. soon to be 24 nothing. As the final seconds of the third quarter tick away. Let's see if Lincoln Hawk can get some decent field position. He gets out just past the 10. Start of the fourth quarter. Doesn't even go to the condition checker. He just goes right into, right into play calling. Goes with a run three. That is called. Looking at second and long. Pro set formation. Singletary the defender. Possible if that ball leaves his hands a little earlier, that might get completed. A tough throw with the, the sharp angles for Jay Schrader to, to make those completions. He tends to overthrow those receivers. Quick condition check on a third long. Pass one is called. And William Perry breaks through the line and gets the safety. Lincoln Hawk. Kicking off to about the 10 yard line, Brad Muster with the ball. And he's been moving pretty fast. Alright, so Odell takes over about the 24 yard line of his of the Bears. Uh, how we long the defender on the play? We have a dive play. And Bailey gets a moderate gain, 5 yards, second down and 5. Long the defender again, and this time we have run three up to the top. Uh, Anderson is uh, stopped just short of the first down. We have a third and short coming up. Shotgun play. Suckers him up. Gentry, with that good condition, is able to just eke out the extra that he needs to get that reception. Diving grab for him. Run one again. It has just been effective all game. Looks like it's bottled up. Reverses field. Anderson gets the first down. Pro set here. Run three. In, in the war of the Andersons, the Bear Anderson is king. And uh, not really sure what uh, Odell was seeing there throwing down. That Anderson was definitely not open, he was double covered 
So we have a second turnover of the game for the Bears. Minute 54 remaining. This point is just for pride and point differential in the tournament. Uh, pass two. Covered by Singletary. Throws it underneath to Schrader. I'm sorry, Schrader throws it underneath to Marcus Allen. Just short of the first down, I think he uh, didn't realize that he didn't have the first down. And we have a called run one. But Jackson has just enough to outmaneuver the pack. Gets out of bounds for a first down. Pass four, Red Gun Z. Throws down to Galt, who is out of bounds. Minute seven remaining in the fourth quarter. Carry the defender, called run three. Jackson runs out of bounds. We have a third and long coming up. Third and 18 from about the 17-yard line. Run one. And it looks like Odell is just in Lincoln Hawk's head today. His He knows what he wants to do. Fourth and 19. At this point, it's whether he punts it or goes for it doesn't really matter. We have a pass four called. And uh, here it looks like Singletary is just rushing to prevent the completion. Force the throw. And the ball's turned over on downs. Pass up to Gentry. Took too long to get there. But he was covered anyway. Run up the middle. And we end the game with a touchdown from Neil Anderson on a run four up the middle. Very little resistance on his way to the end zone. And uh, just in case anyone wonders, uh, the there is no cap to the point differential, so... Odell wasn't trying to rub it in. That's part of the objective is to get the biggest point differential possible. So, congratulations to Odell on a victory. A uh, Lincoln Hawk um, looked like he had a good start, got down early, and then it's kind of spiraled out of control. So, definitely a learning opportunity for him. This is a very common matchup, and uh, hopefully he'll look to improve uh, through his future games here. Uh, Odell, uh, in Odell fashion, with his success and past tournaments like the Kumite, uh, it is. Uh, definitely a Tecmo veteran. Uh, anyone in the community will really know who he is and what uh, what he brings to the table, which is a very solid all-around game. And it shows there. Um, one critique on the game was a couple forced throws with Tom Zach there that uh, probably weren't uh, necessary in those situations that uh, potentially took points off the board, but um, no one's going to debate the, the effectiveness of a 33 to nothing win. So, again, congratulations, guys. Thanks for the video upload, and we'll catch you next time.